Hey guys, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelly. Hi, if you're new. Today, as you guys might be able to tell from the title down below, we are going to be making some of my most popular bracelets and restocking them at night. At night. It is currently 8 o'clock. It is dark outside. It's been gloomy and rainy all day. So I thought, why don't we just make this an aesthetic at night bracelet making video. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, definitely hit that subscribe button down below. I am doing daily videos for the month of May and calling it May Bead Mayhem. I hope you enjoy it. I love sharing tutorials on how I make bracelets, sharing the behind the scenes of my business, Kelly Prepster Studio, which is always linked down below in case you guys want to check it out. All of your support it seriously means the world to me and it's so much fun documenting it here on YouTube and I love making bracelets with you guys so if you are watching my videos and making bracelets be sure to use my hashtag bead buddies in the comments down below and stay tuned for the end of the video to see the comment of the day so be sure to leave a comment because it can get featured in a may bead mayhem video so I hope you guys enjoy we are going to be restocking some of my most popular bracelets today I'll walk you guys through it show you guys all the supplies and I hope you enjoy today's video so I currently have have my little Ikea photo lamp on. There's my makeup vanity. And then I turned my bedroom side night lights to purple. We got the XOXO neon sign over there. And on the floor projecting all these stars is my star projector. This is from Amazon. And you guys, I didn't realize they were projecting onto my face on the intro. So that's what all these little neon lights are, which are projecting all the fun stars onto my wall. And I have another neon sign with some twinkly light. So I think it's safe to say that the room is very aesthetically set up for this at night video. But I'm gonna put some headphones on. I just have my beads. I like to wear these while I'm making bracelets. I've been watching the Vampire Diaries and I'm gonna show you guys how I figure out what my most popular bracelet are. So this is the behind the scenes of my website and I can keep inventory of what's listed and these are everything that have sold out. So I'm going to go by and make some of these more popular bracelets so you know what this means. We need our bracelet making supplies. I have my scissors. These are my little green scissors. I've had them since second grade. They are my favorite. They're just little safety scissors. We are going to need some elastic and this is from Walmart. It's by the brand Go Create and I put one of my Kelly Prepster studio stickers on top of it it is a perfect fit so if you guys want to customize your elastic I do have these for sale on my site so we're gonna need some elastic and I don't think we're gonna be using any charms today these are all over my charms but we are going to need some beads and I saw some girl on TikTok store her beads in her Alex drawer like this and I loved it so we're gonna use my favorite palette and this is just a bunch of beads that I found on Amazon and I had an extra container and put them in here we're also going to be using some clay beads which I found these on Amazon and they have literally every color you could even imagine this one is one of my favorites this is my seed oh my gosh I love the sound of them seed beads we're gonna need that and let's even break out the gold ones and my rainbow alphabet my desk is a hot mess <laughs> so you're gonna need elastic scissors beads and i like to use a tray like this this is just seven inches across they do have jewelry making specific ones as well but this is how i've always made my bracelets and i like to have my elastic over here and i keep it on here until i put all the beads on it then i cut it and tie and that's just something that i've always done so let's get making some bracelets Okay, you guys, I'm going to make one of my favorite ones, which is all the little gummy bear charms. This one recently sold out, so I thought it'd be fun to make a new one. And I just like to line them up in a little bit of a pattern. And let's put some elastic on it and make it into a bracelet.
when you mess up the pattern. It's okay. <laughs> Hey guys, I finished making some of my restocks of my most popular bracelets and this one is so cute. I believe this was called Puppy Fever and I just love the little paw print, especially if you have a dog. I just think it's so cute. Then I made my sugar brush, which is just these little gummy bears and I love the look of this. It's such a fun, unique bracelet and I love how chunky it is. Then this one is my sweet pink or pink sweet, I think. I'm gonna have to get these on my website ASAP, but they're so cute. I love the pearl and like I love how half and half this one i've never made before i wanted to try it out these little star beads were so much smaller than i thought they were going to be and they're kind of funky feeling but i like them and then this one is a remake of one of my really popular best-selling ones but i made it in purple this time so i would love to know in the comments down below out of these four we'll do one two three four five which one is your favorite let me know all right you guys i am interrupting this video to pack two orders with you guys and they are going out to cecilia and Linda. So I just want to thank both of you guys so much for shopping kellyprepsterstudio.com and I can't wait to pack your order. Be sure to check out the link below in the description box to shop my website in case you guys are interested and want to get a shout out in one of my upcoming videos. So let's get started with Linda's order. All right, you guys. So Linda ordered two bracelets. This one is called Rainbow Row and they are these super cute little rainbow smiley faces around a pearl bracelet. It reminds me of my visit to Rainbow Row in Charleston, South Carolina, and it just has a little Kelly Prepster Studio sticker on the back. Then she ordered my heart and key charm bracelet. I have to pull this out. Um, charm bracelet. I'm going to pull this out to show you guys because it is so pretty. Of course, she gets a freebie sticker. I threw in a little Kelly Prepster sticker as well, the little mini one, and then we're going to write a handwritten note and put it in a pink bubble mailer. 
today we're gonna be using a purple sharpie so i'm gonna write the note and show you guys this bracelet so her charm bracelet is so cute guys this was one of my first charm bracelets i have made and i love all of the red detailing on it so it's got little lips a heart a key some cherries a strawberry a star and a flower this strawberry charm is my favorite it has like a little gem on it i just think it's so cute i can't wait to see you style this linda so thank you so much for shopping put it back in this super cute little holographic bag and let's write a thank you card All right, so I wrote Linda, ah, thank you so much for shopping my site. I hope you love it all. P.S. I packed your order on my YouTube at kellyprepsterstudio.com, XOXO Kelly. So we are gonna pack this up. Also wrote on the back, which is kind of silly since this one has hearts, but her mom reached out to me and this is for Abigail. So I said, hi Abigail, thanks for watching, hashtag bead buddies because her and her mom watch my channel together. Seriously, so stinking cute. So we are gonna package up your order and put it in here so I have this. A thank you card. And I'm going to put her stickers inside of the receipt. Along with the two bracelets. So cute. I also recently got these super cute fragile stickers off of Amazon and I feel like they just make my package look so cute. And I'm gonna put a pink thank you for supporting my small business sticker on their package. So thank you so much, Linda and Abigail. I hope you both enjoy these bracelets and thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel. It's so fun to connect with you guys. You guys are my bead buddies and I hope you love your bracelets. So now we are gonna pack my second order for Cecilia. All right, so this is Cecilia's order. She ordered my gummy bear bracelet. This is one of my favorite ones. It's so cute. She ordered a bead buddies bracelet along with this super cute orange smiley face one with the matching green one. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. She also ordered my purple keep smiling and this is half seed beads, half clay with some pearls. I just love the look of these beads. They're so colorful, perfect for spring and summer. She ordered my favorite little seed bead with smiley faces, my little strawberry shortcake one. How cute is the little strawberry on this? Along with that, she ordered two of my glass bead bracelets. Now these are bigger, heavier glass beads and I think they're just absolutely stunning so cute and then one of my bangles with this super cute little heart charm on it i'm trying to get my camera to focus oh my gosh so cute and she also ordered one of my kelly prepster stickers so this is the two inch one that i put on top of my elastic let me show you guys it's in this drawer and it fits on there perfectly i just wanted to show you my desk is a mess but so this is the one that i've including in freebie so you get the bigger one and then she gets two freebie stickers and for cecilia i'm throwing in this friends bracelet she's so sweet she watches all my videos and i'm so grateful for all the love and support but she doesn't make bracelets so we threw this one in because it's fitting because she is a bead buddy but she's also a friend so let's pack this up let's write a cute handwritten note and thank you so much cecilia So I wrote, Cecilia, hi again, happy spring. I hope you love everything. Thank you for ordering again, love ya, Kelly. So that's done and we're going to put some of her bracelets in one of these organza bags. This is one of my favorite parts. They're just so cute and happy. This bag is so colorful. Oh my gosh, wouldn't that just be so much fun to open? I really think it reminds me of like a fun mystery bundle, but they're all such great picks. They're gonna look so cute together. So we got all of the bracelets in their little work on zip bags and I'm gonna get her packing slip and put her stickers inside of here. And put these in 
her bubble mailer. And for Cecilia's order, we are going to put on this gorgeous green thank you for supporting my small business sticker. Thank you so much, Cecilia, for shopping my site. Again, I can't express how thankful I am to have your support, and it means the world to me. So I hope you love all of your new bracelets. They're seriously so cute. I would love to see how you style them, and I hope you both enjoy your new bracelets. I will be getting these in the mail as soon as possible, so I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this bracelet-making video. I love remaking my popular best-selling bracelets and I think it's so much fun to make them with you. I love the new at night bracelet making. I don't know if you guys found it aesthetic. I just thought it was really fun. So let me know in the comments down below how you like that if you did or didn't. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below so you can get notified when tomorrow's next May Bead Mayhem video goes live. Here is the comment of the day so don't forget I am doing a comment shout out in every video so if you leave a comment down below I might feature it in tomorrow's video so definitely use that at hashtag bead buddies if you're making a bracelet with me honestly i just think of our community as bead buddies whether you make bracelets or not so again i hope you enjoyed today's video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys back here tomorrow with another new video bye guys